Hi guys, Jamie from Boxing Life, and today I'm going to be doing a review on Phil Daru's Body Armor program. Stay tuned. So guys, before I get started on this, um, I just want to basically go over a little bit of background about the actual program, who Phil Daru is, uh, show you me doing some of the exercises that are part of the program and um, some of the pros and cons and also just give you my final verdict on if I think it's worth it for you. Getting onto that I think the best place to start is who is Phil Daru? So, so primarily Phil Daru is a strength and conditioning coach for the American top team and he's trained multiple boxing and MMA champions including the likes of Dustin Poirier Sullivan Barbera, Maureen Shea, uh, Masvidal and yeah he's a tremendous strength and conditioning coach. I think in actual fact he was an MMA fighter himself so he totally understands the mindset of fighters and that's really imp that's a really important thing for me is that you know he gets what it's about or he, he gets what the fighter wants. Because of that, he's made multiple programs, obviously the body armor program. So because he's uh, trained some of these top fighters, he's actually gone and made his own kind of business, I guess, and he's released multiple strength and conditioning programs, mainly targeted towards MMA fighters or and boxers as well. So for example, there's obviously the body armor program. There's another program, the fight ready, which I've also done. I'll maybe do a separate video for this, but I'll give you some detail on that at the end of this video. And he's also got other strength and conditioning ones for boxing specific and also uh, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu as well. So he's definitely worth checking that, checking out. I'll leave descriptions below so you can have a look. <clears throat> so first up, here's just an overview of the actual program itself. And it's six to eight weeks and it's designed to basically just increase your strength, your power, agility, um, and just really your overall strength and conditioning so you can perform while you're actually competing or sparring in the ring or octagon. It comes in kind of like four different sets, so it's like power and strength, and then there's two conditioning kind of sessions that you do. So each time you do it for the week as well, uh, it kind of changes, so you're not just doing the same thing, so like, one day you'll be doing leg work and then you'll be doing upper body stuff. Now the great thing about the body armor program is that you don't really need any equipment. Some of the exercises you do and you can maybe change it to something else. So if you don't have much equipment, don't worry, but it really is limited to what you actually need. In terms of what you actually get from the body armor program, you obviously get this PDF. Uh, lifetime access once you get it. It's all got detail in terms of when you should be training and the rep repetitions you should be doing, how quickly you should be doing it. So it has all the detail and it's just, you just need to follow it precisely to get the results. Um, you also get access to Daru Strong's membership hub and you get access to the Phil Daru Facebook group. So like-minded individuals are on there and um, Daru's team obviously post different things on there as well so you can it's a real kind of community feel and also because you bought this you'll get discounts off future strength and conditioning programs if you wish to, to take part in them that's how i managed to get a discount off fight ready which is a little bit more expensive than body armor but it's definitely worth checking that out now going into detail about the body armor program now so the way it's done is through smart goal setting so for those that don't know what a smart goal is well I'll explain it to you right now. Usually the most successful athletes, coaches, business owners have all used the SMART formula to reach short and long-term goals. And before you start off the program, you'll see in the PDF that that's what Phil challenges you to do, to actually use that as a way to get the results that you want. So for those that don't know, SMART stands for, so S for specific, M for measurable, A, achievable, are relevant to time. So I actually think this is a really good thing Phil's done to get you motivated to actually do the goals you need to do and make sure you're following a strict routine as I feel like that's really the only way you can 
get the results. And personally, I did it during lockdown, so I didn't really have much equipment and stuff. And I found it that worked perfectly for me. I got really good results in terms of my overall strength. Shows by doing like smart goals, you're more likely to actually get motivated to achieve your goals and get the results that you want. So I think it's a really good thing Phil's actually done to put it in there. Um, so it makes you a bit more motivated to follow the program correctly. Um, it is in a weekly schedule, so you can follow it. I recommend you check out my written review just to kind of show you a structure in terms of what it looks like. It's really good in terms of, you know, following it. Obviously it's a weekly workout, so the sessions are split up into weekly segments. So let's get right into it and show you me doing one of his workouts. Uh, just some of the exercises you do. There's some of them look, are a bit funny, like, but I found it, they've actually really helped my overall strength and even agility as well. So this is an upper body workout just to kind of show you what it looks like. All right. Now that I've shown you kind of a live example of some of the exercises that you'll do, um, I just wanted to kind of go over some other points I wanted to make about the program. Is the Body Armor program best for? Well, personally, I think it's for those that, you know, are wanting to work out from home or just wanting to try something different without having to spend tons of money on equipment and whatnot. Um, it's also really good, you know, like as a, you know, as someone that does boxing training to mix and match without having to lift heavy weights. Weights have their time in their place, definitely. And I recommend if you'd rather do kind of weight training alongside your boxing to maybe consider the Fight Ready program. To finish off, let's go over some of the pros and cons of this. Now, number one, you don't need much equipment, which is great. Uh, you maybe need pull-up bars, stuff like that, as I couldn't do, like a, a pull-up push-up, so like you lie above a barbell. Not many people have something like that to do that on, so you're having to like improvise at home, as you saw in my video there. Technically, you do this these exercises in a gym, so that's also an option. Another pro is the schedule and the plan. It's all mapped out for you. You know, I think that's a big issue for a lot of people is they just don't know where to start. Phil Daru has absolutely put it all down on paper, 
and it can look a bit overwhelming at first. You're like, oh my God, I don't know where to start. But once you get into the habit of just following it, what he says exactly, you're fine. And then also just measuring your results as you go along. That's really key. The number of reps you do, uh, the time you take, and it's, it's suitable for beginners right up to professionals. You know, it's, you know, it, I see it as anyone can do strength and conditioning. You don't need to be talented. Um, anyone can learn the techniques. Some of them are obviously need to be strong enough to do them over time and consistently well with good technique, but you don't really need talent to be good at doing strength and conditioning exercises. And that is a pro. And then another big pro is like, you start to feel a real difference after a couple, see the first week of following this program alongside like other training, like boxing or MMA, because you'll work on muscles, which you're not used to working on. Just some of the movements you do, like the, those monkey jumps and the bear crawl stuff, you know, you're working on muscles you're not usually using. And yeah, that's, that's a really good plus for me because you're working your whole body. You're getting a full body workout almost um, every single time. Let's get on to the cons. Now, you have to stick to the schedule if you want to see results. I think too many people, they'll buy something, they'll sign up for something and they just won't follow it through. And then they'll complain that it doesn't work. Well, did you actually follow the six to eight week plan? That's the question I say to a lot of people. It's like, did you actually follow through with it? For at least the full plan, you know? You want to see results, you have to stick with it. A negative, and I kind of mentioned this before, is that there's a bit in back and forth between the PDF and looking at the technique on YouTube. So you need to kind of have like a laptop or your phone nearby. It's not ideal sometimes. That's why I kind of recommend you kind of watch through first and then you do it. If you forget, you can always go back or get out your phone and have a quick look. It doesn't hurt. You can make your own playlist on YouTube so then you can remind yourself if you forget one of the techniques. But the other thing as well, it's only kind of body weight exercises which i guess is a con in some ways i do think like lifting weights and having equipment can help you progress a lot quicker than just doing the body weight exercises but this is why this program is slightly different if you're totally set on get using equipment to progress your strength and conditioning i highly recommend you check out his fight ready program i'll leave that in the description below for you to check out and just final thoughts guys, I think um, the good thing about it is there's a 60 day money back guarantee. So if you're not happy with it, you can get your money back. So you're not really losing money if you're not happy at all. So I think that's a really good deal Phil's put in there for people that aren't happy with what they're getting. But personally, I think if you follow it, you're not going to be unhappy. So you're a winner either way. The other thing I like, I like how it's very mixed. It's something totally different um and yeah i guess it, it's more suited for mixed martial artists at the end of the day but boxers can do it too i found it really useful some of that upper body stuff i found it really useful for me and it just changed up my training in lockdown when things were like a bit crazy and i you know i still use these exercises today with the gyms open i'll still do some of them and i think that's a really good thing I think it's really good just to change up your training routine and just try something a bit different. Finally guys, I do recommend like if you do buy it, make sure you print it out. That's the best way to follow it and then you can track your progress. Or if you're a real geek, you can like set up a spreadsheet online and then track your progress on there. Uh, it's a really good program. I highly recommend you, tr you consider it anyway if you're needing a plan to get stronger for your training and for your, for your MMA or boxing training and I highly recommend you check them out. I'll also leave my written reviews for these in the description below, as I mentioned earlier, and you can check those out. As always, I really appreciate you guys watching. It means a lot, all the support. Make sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.